Hi, welcome to We Play Golf. Today I'm going to show you that a strong grip is not the way to go when you play golf. Welcome back to We Play Golf, the golf channel where you easily learn how to play golf. If you are new to the channel, please consider subscribing. And if you have any questions or suggestions, put them in our comment box below. In today's video, we'll talk about what happens if you have a strong grip and how you can find out where you are in a strong grip and what it really does in your swing when you have a strong grip. What we can see with the grip like this one is if you have your left hand on top and your right hand is way under the club, that means that the index finger is more underneath the club instead of being on the side of the club. If that's a strong position, you will find out that when you swing down to the ball, that the rolling wrist action, the hand action, will be blocked. Because if you do this, the club face will be completely shut and you might hit very, very deep divots into the ground and find the ball every time in the left side in the rough. Did you know that on your grip, you have dots to show you the correct position? And if you didn't know that, let us know in the comment box below. To make sure you can keep the grip correctly, you got your left hand on top. Try to find the V or a little dot. And this is what we're going to do. The little dot in the middle of your index and your thumb will fit straight in that position here. So this and this will be always in the same position. Now, in this position, the right hand is square to the hitting part of the club face. So if you hold it way too much under, you'll find out that the club will be closed as you hit the ball. So there's a lot of things that can happen and will change if you do that. I'll show you a few things. One of the major points I see with people with a strong grip is they cannot release the club face down to the ball because the club is already closed. They have to block the shot. So by blocking the shot, their shoulder rotation, hip rotation will be less active in their swing. So they'll be more hitting shots like this or holding and they won't be able to be releasing the club face. If they do so, I'll show you. So I got the normal neutral position in the left hand, but a strong right hand. If I release a club down, the club face will be shut and you'll find a very thin divot because the club face is already shut before impact. If I keep the club neutral, so the right hand with the index finger on the side, the thumb over the club and just relaxed hand. If I swing the club now, I know that the club face is square and I can release the club more and the ball will go straight. So if you've had a strong grip, you will not be able to release a club face because the club face is already shut because of the position. And if the club is neutral, you'll have that easy release, easy momentum in your hands. So I hope you realize what the difference is between a neutral grip and a strong grip and what the big effects would be if you have a strong grip. This is how we play golf. See you next time. This is a little check. If you push your both hands way forwards, you'll see that the clip is square. So now I know that I have a good grip. I can let the clip go. If you had the clip strong and you push your hands forwards, it will be closed and it will give you a hook. <laughs> 